Hi, I'm Jonathan Katzmoses, YouTuber, male model, and inventor of the Katzmoses Magnetic Dovetail Jig. Now, when David over at Popular Woodworking asked me to host Popwood Playback, I thought, what a great fit. I know woodworking. So in the interest of showing you the great content that's over on my channel, I'm gonna give you some of my top woodworking tips while I run you down my favorite videos of the week. My first tip is for my longtime teacher and mentor, Bruce Lee. If you've made a cut and you can't safely reach the off switch on your table saw, you can just snatch the blade like this. So use that to get out of a sticky situation. Our first video comes from Mike Farrington. He's doing a series of shop projects this summer, and this week he builds a torsion box workbench with a really innovative downdraft table built in. His dry sense of humor, massive shop, and 20 years of woodworking experience make this Denver native a must watch. Next tip uses the little brother of the table saw, the skill saw. If you ever get tired of sanding slowly, you can just set your skill saw to 1 64th and just go to town. <laughs> It's much safer than using those high RPM orbital sanders, and it really makes quick work of it. Our next video is Modustrial Maker. Now this build really isn't woodworking, but it's a really cool technique using a mix of GFRC concrete, pigments, and wood. Mike makes a really thin slab, it's really strong fiberglass impregnated concrete that looks like marble, and then surrounds it with a bamboo frame. It's great to hear him talk you through the process and highlight both his failures and successes and how he got to the end product. My next tip is how to get a razor sharp point on a pencil. So using a honing guide, you can put your pencil in, ensuring that it's square, and then make about 30 strokes on your sharpening stone. And just like that, you get a razor sharp edge. Bonus points if we take it over to the buffing wheel and get this thing really sharp. My next video is a real fun one. A glimpse inside made a wooden lamp using cicadas cast in resin. Chris goes through the whole process from casting the bugs to getting an ultra clear finish on epoxy and then making and wiring the lamp. It came out really cool and what a unique idea. Our next tip is more of a life tip than a woodworking tip. If you've got a client coming to the shop and your shirt's all dirty from working all day, you can just use your dust collector to clean it. Whoa, I've never had it change colors before. Our next video is from David Picciuto at Make Something. David's been doing some really cool stuff lately with his cinematography and building style. This week he released the second video in his series about building a cherry modular cabinet. He needs some help making a design choice, so head on over to the video and tell him what style of doors you like. All right, our next tip is a good one. I like to call it double trouble. If you want to Double the time that you're getting stuff done with your hand planes, you can use two hand planes at once. Grab them each by the handle and just go nuts. Works wonders. Our next video is from Nobel Peace Prize winning woodworker, Katz Moses Woodworking. This devilishly handsome and intelligent maker made the most popular modern planner on Amazon. It's a quick build with some really fun techniques like turning square stock into dowels without using a lathe. This quite possibly may be the best video ever released on the internet. Guys, I wanted to thank David for letting me host Popwood Playback this week. I had a great time. Head over to my YouTube channel and check it out or pick up one of my dovetail jigs and CNC alignment boards. Uh, everything is linked below. And for God's sakes, do not try anything I did in this video. Except, except maybe the modern planner. Try the modern planner. Have a great day and stay safe in the shop, guys.